I am Sabelos Banda, the People's Law Activist. I work towards ensuring that as much as possible, people's rights are protected. Some of the people are not aware of the proposed national health regulations amendments. It is important to realize what exactly this means for all of us. These regulations basically declare a scenario where everyone will end up in one of three categories, where you are either deemed to be a case or you are considered a suspect, or alternatively, you are considered as one who has been in contact with someone who is a case. And once you fall into any one of these three categories, this is what this means for you. Government says you may not refuse to be medically examined, whereby the medical examination process is whatever government will determine. Second to that, you may not refuse to be put in quarantine or put in isolation. And the requirements for quarantine and isolation are such that the majority of the people of South Africa will not be able to self-quarantine, so they have to be put in a state institution. Further to that, and most critical, is that you may not refuse to take whatever medication that the government says you should take. Your freedom, which is supposed to be guaranteed and protected by the same act in as far as the right to be informed, is taken away. You are caught in a situation whereby government has full control. Once you are put in this isolation space, this quarantine space, you don't have the ability to determine when and how you get out. It will be up to government to decide. So now the country of South Africa will be under a permanent state of disaster where masking will be um, permanent, where social distancing is permanent through the National Health Act. If you as a South African care about the freedom of this country, if you care about the rights of the people of this country, then you have to participate in this particular process. You have to let government know the people of South Africa have a right to decide whether these regulations will come to pass or will not come to pass. I call upon you as South Africans to stand up and make your voice heard. You have the power to protect the sovereignty of every individual. We have got until the 5th of August for us to be able to make our contributions. On the links below are different platforms by which you can participate. Please get up, be active. Thank you very much.